Well, hello. So today we're going to speak about Steve Harvey recently in the news, and we're going to go back to some racist elements that Steve Harvey has said. Now, I don't watch Steve Harvey. I've always found Steve Harvey to be rather annoying. <laughs> Let's just be honest with you. There's something off. There was something always off about Steve Harvey for me. And then when Steve Harvey says those racist jokes about the Asian community, about uh, and I'm not going to repeat them. And if you want to look them up on the internet, you can look them up on the internet. Um, it just to me, when you destroy the life of one individual, you know that's that's a difficult thing. But when you destroy the life of an entire population of individuals by saying that people who dates these kind of people, I I was flabbergasted I was dismayed I was destroyed to a certain degree by the understanding that NBC would have this kind of rhetoric and this kind of communication being given to humanity this kind of subliminal brainwashing yeah no like it's I am a celebrity I am celebrated I am giving you this information and, and whether it's a joke or whether it's it's a subliminal kind of jab at a specific culture and as we move forward, as the Chinese market, as the Asian market in general is growing very, very rapidly, I think that NBC really needs to, in order to step up in the forefront of, of communication and in order to abridging the gap of, of the economic growth of, of both nations, I would imagine that NBC really needs to address this situation. I think that and it's been a, I think that NBC has thought, well, people are not talking about it. And I, it's like, you know, it's, it's people are talking about it. They're just not telling you about it. And perhaps the question becomes, is it in the, does it show in the ratings? I think that, that perhaps this could be the rantings of a, of a, whatever. You know what I mean? But when you look at the numbers and when you look at the ratings and when you look at the statistics and you, when you look at, perhaps you need to poll people and be like, hey, what's the situation? Now, what would be revolutionary for NBC to do is to have Margaret Cho host a daily show in the morning. Or for someone else, maybe Fox, maybe someone else to host and be like, mm, we're going to have Margaret Cho. And that would be like, boom. That would be just revolutionary for at that particular same time slot with Steve Harvey. Oh, that would be tough. Or if NBC would go ahead and be like, we're going to be revolutionary. Just like we're having NBC Saturday Night Live crank out their amazing jokes, we're going to be a revolutionary. We're going to have Margaret Cho. But I really do think that moving forward, Steve Harvey has really tarnished his reputation with that particular joke. And for me personally, I'm just turned off by the guy. I'm just completely turned off by the guy. Are you turned off to Steve Harvey? Do you think that NBC really needs to reevaluate the situation with Steve Harvey? Because I can tell you, I will not, not only if he's on, if I randomly turn on the TV and he's on, I will change the channel. And if there's a commercial about him, I will change the channel. I will not, I cannot stand, I cannot stand because it reminds me of that particular term. And it, it makes me think of the pain that it caused so many people. And uh, the ripple effect of the energy of that kind of effect of saying, you know, you all people, you are not light. So you will not be able to breed. That's pretty. That's, that's, that's intense. That's intense, right? Do you agree? Do you disagree? I want to wish you all a wonderful, whether you agree or disagree, I want to wish you all a wonderful, wonderful year. And what does NBC think? Well, we'll find out. Thank you. Take care.